uh, Farid is busy telling Anneli about uh, this whole story of uh, Paul and Virginie. Sur ce monument, on nous, montre, on nous explique un peu ce qui s'est passé. On nous montre les lieux les plus euh, mythiques du crash. Parce qu'on rappelle, c'est un truc qui date de très longtemps, 1744. 1744. Et euh, sur ces petits pictogrammes, les I expliquent, expliquent où se trouve l'île d'Ambre, tout ça exactement. Et le S, donc S, saint gérard Press. Donc c'est là où euh, euh, s'est craché euh, euh, le navire, le navire où était Virginie qui est morte, qui est morte suite à un accident. Voilà. Merci. Yes. Merci. C'est quelque chose de très, euh, très important pour les Français et les Mauriciens aussi, qu'ils apprennent ça à l'école. They, they learn this story, this story at school. Yes. Yeah, okay. It's like Romeo and Juliet. Yes. Like exactly. Exactly. Mm. So here in Mauritius, they learn the story at school. Mm. Yes, and a young, uh, young class. Okay, what's your name? My name is Farid. 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 Okay, and you are from France? Yes, I'm from France. Oh, wonderful, okay. And do you mind if we put you on YouTube? Yes, we can do this. All right, thank yeah. you. I'm Gerdes, and uh, we are out and about today here in Mauritius. And today we are at a place called Potre de Oog. Uh, it's here in the very north part of the island. and. Um, we are visiting the uh, statue or the place where uh, Virginia uh, drowned. She drowned quite close to this uh, this uh, area. Now the the story of Paul and Virginia cannot be told better than uh, uh, that Ferry told it to me in French. And uh, but those of you who don't understand French, it's almost like a Romeo and Juliet story. The two children were uh, kind of promised to each other. And then Virginia went to France uh, for a while, I uh, think to study, and Paul stayed behind, and she came back to marry him. They were uh, 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 childhood sweethearts. She came back to marry him, and then as they got to the island, she, uh, the, the ship floundered and uh, she was drowned uh, in sight of the island. And it's such a sad story. And uh, today we're here at the, at the uh, actually the, the memorial needle, all built out of lava rock, very humble. But let me go and show you the, uh, the needle itself and the inscription over there. Come with me. It's a small obelisk that we are looking at. Um, it says the Saint Geran, um, and it tells us that in uh, 1744 the ship actually floundered and um, so they want to immortalize this this site and um, in fact this could only be a story uh, because I don't know if it's really true uh, nobody knows if it's really true now uh, the writer was uh, Bernardine uh, de Saint-Pierre and the novel is uh, Paul and Virginia this novel was already uh, written in 1844 all over the island you can find little bits and pieces of Paul and Virginia and uh, I appreciate you watching my video today and uh, I hope that you watch my others as well. We uh, uh, just having a look around at, uh, at the bay and um, uh, it's uh, and I, I appreciate I appreciate you watching my video and I hope that you will subscribe and that you'll become um, a, um, a regular follower of our, um, our blog, our uh, video blogs and um, uh, this is just a typical uh, site in Mauritius um, you don't see any sandy beaches here but this is local life, uh, local fishermen and um, I'm here with my friends uh, Quilly and um, so um, we're just concluding this video and have fun and God bless.